So I free space. That go back. No. <laughs> And now for our feature presentation. Okay, everybody. That's true. I'm thinking Jay might know a few things about the Disney store, so we'll see what happens. And... Why we get him in here? All right. I'd like to welcome you all to my fourth game of Wheel of Fortune for the Saga CD, which so far have won $168,700. And I just got shot by Daniel Monahan's gun. Uh, I mean Sega CD. Sega. And yep, I won $168,700. Let's see if I can win more. It looks like the THX uh, logo there, Daniel. What? It's very rare to find a TX logo, TX logo after a Blu-ray movie. I know. What movie is that? Titanic. Oh, you just got done watching Titanic? Yep. Oh, okay. That's what's up. Ugh. I know he would appreciate that very much. Yeah. And just for that reason, I'm going to name the computer players Jack and Rose. Jack and Rose? That sounds like a good idea. So that's what I'll do. There's something that I can't get out of my head about Titanic. Two years ago, on a Saturday in August 2013, on ABC Family, there was a Disney movie marathon consisting of The Hunchback of Notre Dame, Hercules, Cinderella, and The Princess and the Frog. But guess what aired before Hunchback? What? Titanic. Is the top not the Disney movie. Nope, it, they aired it before the Disney marathon started. Yeah, because Titanic was on from 8 o'clock in the morning until 12.30 in the afternoon. We'll start with player one. I mean, don't get me wrong. Titanic's a great movie and everything, but 
Why air it if before a, the start of a Disney movie marathon? That doesn't make sense. Yeah. But I remember right at one point when the $200. when the end credits were starting for Titanic, when it went to the split credits. That's when The Hunchback of Notre Dame started. So The Hunchback of Notre Dame started during Titanic split credits. That was very good. Australian for beer. There is one eight. And uh, I'll take it in a mug. Nice work. Foster's Australian for beer. We're going back on a bottle or a mug. I'll take it in a mug. Well, I bought an I, but there were none, so... What are you watching now? I'm now watching the trailers of Titanic. Oh, okay, because I saw a 20th Century Fox logo. <laughs> yeah, but later on they decided to use the... Paramount. Paramount logo. Yeah, because Paramount distributed the film in North America, in the United States, while 20th Century Fox re uh, released it internationally, outside of North America. I uh, read an article about it. I mean, they both worked on the film together, but while Paramount took care of the U.S. theatrical release and 20th Century Fox handled it outside the U.S. Speaking of Titanic, uh, back in uh, May, whenever I went to the telethon and I gave my friends all their VHS tapes, even though Titanic is not Disney, I got them a VHS copy of Titanic. Oh. Yeah. Well, their mom has seen the movie, but they've never seen it, so. There are two oh, I know what it is. This thing is a particular food that I love to eat. It's just PMJ asking him how much he knows about the Disney store, Disney ring carpet. Uh huh. Yeah, you might answer soon. Yeah. And Rose lands on a lose a turn. Lose a turn. It's beginning to look a lot like the next player's yeah. turn. Time for them to take their turn. Now, that trailer you're watching for Titanic, I remember it very well. Contestant number yeah. one. It's your turn. Huh. What is it? He says he knows a good not about Disney Store or Disney Red Carpet. Oh, great. He's just your guy. Seven fifty. 
$750. R. There is one R. <sighs> Spin. Good job. Thank you, Vanna. Will you go out with me? No flirting with I like the way you said that too. No flirting with Vanna or I'm gonna put you over my knee. <laughs> I like that. <laughs> there is one. Well you you did. Twenty two hundred dollars, I'll solve it. Corn on the cob. Solve that puzzle. Oh, you have to hit this button. There we go. So I'm walking away with something this game, no matter what happens. You know what the most famous catchphrase of Titanic is? I'm the king of the world! Well, I'm going to buy the man out of the cafe of That's right. And what's our category for our second round? It's a person, and the person is Daniel Monahan. That is incorrect. My butt. I agree. Besides, he did not steal that diamond. There are no keys. Besides, it was a setup. It, it was a setup by Lovejoy. Uh-huh. A James Cameron film. I was reading the text that said a James Cameron film. Yep. From the director of T from the director of T two and True Lies. Three hundred dollars. There is one L. Titanic. Oh, and Rose lands on the ocean cruise. Yeah, exactly. But let's see if she gets to pick it up first. In. Yep. She gets to pick it up, alright. I would have said survived. Yeah, me too. Definitely survived. Lose a turn. <laughs> Rose gotta lose a turn. My turn. My turn. Right, so 
episode of the Saturday Night Live parody of Titanic, I promise you, you're going to laugh your head off. I believe it. Just like how I laugh at Robo having nightmares about Hong Kong 97. $500. Jay says he's not sure about what to do with Disney Store or Disney Great Carpet. Oh, hmm. Should we get him in here? If you wish. Nice work. Uh, excuse me. Where are your manners? All over that iceberg. Come in, come in, sir. Here we go. Three hundred. I'll go with an S. There is one S. Yeah. Oh. Hey, Jay. Uh, I actually have two people that might want to end up joining up soon. Who are they? I have another problem with them at the moment. Okay, who are they? I'm so sorry if I bet. Alright, bring them in. Oh. I'm so sorry if I caught you at a bad time, Jay. Hey, no, it's fine. No, not at all, Daniel. Yeah, bring Lee and Craig in here. Uh, I get them. Slow down, Leo. Oh! Oh! I gotta lose a turn. Hang on, I'll get them in here. Uh, excuse me. In your gun. Because you're holding a gun. No. <laughs> I gotta lose a turn. Oh boy. Oh well. So I'm. That needs to be coming. Bring him in. There's surprise, Lee. Surprise. Hello. Daniel, Daniel. It's been a while. Now, episode four of Disney Jeopardy is under construction as of this moment. And. Hey, the Craigmeister! I know Lee is one of them. I'm sorry, the other two. I'm sorry? Steve and Robin are the other two. Okay. Hi, Craig! And I still haven't really gotten my uh, redemption in yet from the last time. So, if we... Would it be okay if I brought Jay back in a future episode? That's up to you. Yes. Yeah, because I really hadn't gotten my redemption in for the third, uh, for uh, episode three since Marty took my place. And uh, you came at a good time, Liam Craig, because I'm actually uh, taping a game. Wow, you're already taping a game? Yeah, we're playing Wheel of Fortune for the Saga CD. Listen, Ow! I mean, by the way, Aubrey. So I quote you, Craig. All right, then. All right. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and uh, Craig, after uh, work on Friday, you know where I'm going. Little Caesars. Pizza, pizza. Pizza, pizza. <laughs> <laughs> pizza, pizza. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Actually, yeah, Craig, because it's been a long time since I last spoke to you, I had some Little Caesars pizza for the first time. Awesome! And the reason why I haven't... Well, there is one in Toronto, but the reason why it took me so long is because uh, there was... there All the locations are completely outside of my local jurisdiction. Like, I live closer to the downtown core, but the but, but, the, but the restaurants themselves are outside the... Um, of, of uh, the local jurisdiction. Meaning that uh, if you were going to go to the pick up a pizza, we have to, we have to drive 10 miles... And miles I have to say miles because a lot of you guys are Americans. There are three R's. Three R's, wow. Uh, oh, hi, Tyler. Hi, 
Tiger. And also, uh, if, if you didn't catch my Facebook post recently, I started falling in love with Putin. Okay. Now, Putin is actually yeah, French fries, good. but uh, but indulge in gravy and and uh, melted cheese. And I told Lee about this recently, that not so long ago, Corey used a puzzle about Putin on uh, Second Fortune. Oh, yeah. I've never tried it, but I will one day, for sure. Okay. Alright. Uh, while you guys uh, chillax, I'm going to go prepare the video you sent. Alright. And I'll let you know right now we're in round two, but we should be finished with this game in a few minutes. Okay. Free spin! Alright! Pick up that free spin. I'll take a, a D as in Daniel Monahan. There is one D. My butt! <laughs> Give me one second, Geeks. Alright then. <laughs> so, hey, Craig. Yes? Did you know I own a Wii U now? No, I have not. I do own one now. Alright. And I now own a record player. I know what you're thinking. How many records do I have right now? Six. Yeah. I have six. Oh, nice. Yep. Tears for Fears, Wham, Cool in the Gang, uh, Phil Collins, um, Steve Winwood, and Boss Gags. But yeah, pretty soon I'm going to start doing what Gary does on Facebook, posting the songs for my records on my Facebook. Speaking of which, Gary and I were, uh, Gary and I were going Vice City crazy on Facebook last that night. Oh yeah? Good. Yeah, we were both quoting Tommy Rossetti from the Grand Theft Auto series. Well, unfortunately for me, last night, after Second Fortune, I had to get off for the night because I had to wake up at 5.30 this morning. Yeah, I had to work from 7.30 to 5. You're making a lot of moolah, which is good. Yeah, exactly. And besides, I worked 7.30 to 5 today. $300. All this is a long drive. It explains why um, I couldn't reach you a couple times before. But I, but I did leave a message to uh, inform you that, you, that, that I'm ready when you are. Right. I didn't get on until about 7.15 my time. Because right when I came home, I watched some uh, TV for a little bit. That's cool, right? But I'm here now, so... And it's... Oh, I feel like... Oh, no, so um, I didn't show a lot of things because it's been a while since I left Saudi Arabia, but just to recap, find out this and off of... Uh, one of my favorite YouTube stores recently. Okay. Your skill, your screen's still loaded. Give it some time. The category is Alright, here's what I got. Okay. Alright, here's what I got. Round three starts with player two. Oh, and B it just came up the Incredibles. Yeah, it's very, it's that hard to find. It is. Holy, holy. Um. Well, you, why don't you show Craig about the Holy Grail sing-along songs that you got? Yeah, I already showed him. What? Yo, yeah, I already showed him. Five hundred dollars. Yeah, and that I, what I actually showed you is a video and two. echo microphone kit. Now the echo microphone it, it works just like a regular microphone, but instead of using a wire, it has uh, some form of a uh, echo wave. Let's see. Awesome. I don't know what kind of technology because if you sing like this, um, I can actually show what the little girl looks like. She thinks like she's a superstar. But where's the white $300. Um, there is one R. I was so excited about that time. Uh, Disneyland turning 60 years old. Yeah. Well, there is one eye. Is that as old as my dad? Wow. 
By the way, I'm currently filming the 5-1 birthday special. Uh, uh, not uh, directly filming, but one of these uh, birthday guys is on Skype with us right now. That's, and I'm doing a birthday special for him already. Is it for uh, our good pal, Daniel Bale? Yep. Awesome! I did one for him myself recently. Not, well, not just, well, not just Daniel, but for Ben Spinning, too. Oh, that's nice. Now, the problem is that, that I've been getting is that um, I have my old charger. My laptop has been shutting down constantly. But now, because I've got a new charger on my hands, I guess I shouldn't have this problem. Because there one two because one common thread I read says you need a new charger. I get you. I see. There is one you. Uh... Oh gosh. What is this puzzle? Hmm. Oh yeah, hey guys. Yeah? Sometime this weekend, you know what I'm planning to get? What? Mario Kart 8. Awesome. Two hundred dollars. Another game that you should no. probably, another game that you should probably get for your Wii U at there some point no in the future. Games. Super Smash Brothers for Wii U. I plan to. Yes. Can anybody hear me? Okay. I can hear you. Contestant number one, it's your turn. Oh yeah, hey Jay. Uh. You know how much I like trash. You know how much I like trash. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody stop those pants! Must be the. <laughs> I'm losing weight. We'll get him back. Six hundred dollars. We'll get him back. We'll get him back. There is one in. Oh. Um. I'm gonna have to buy an E. There are two E. Okay, good. Uh, I'm gonna have to spin. Good job. Boy, that was scary. It's all right. I was, my service was blackened out. Oh no. For about two minutes. So that's why. But right now I'm currently charging my laptop so that I can showcase uh, what I want to showcase on my side without uh, forced interruptions. Right. Especially during filming of. The fourth episode of my Disney Jeopardy. Well, one circumstance was made possible one time. And I was not happy when that happened. There is one L. Yes, except that there was Robo's internet. It was, it was Robo's internet that was derping. Yeah. Oh, I know what it is. Was it my internet? That was very good. No. Robo's. Oh, yeah. Robo Ranger. Robo Rager 1. That's him. Yep. So, and so resulting in that, we had to recruit a backup scorekeeper. Which which wasn't really deemed easy. Six hundred. Because I can't really count anything myself. There is one in One other twelve hundred dollars? I'm ready to solve it. Perpetual motion. Is this uh the end of round three? Yeah, it's the end of round three. We're about to go into round four, and then after round four is the bonus round. In which I'll tell you right now, in this run, I'm very close to $200,000. But zoo. <laughs> oh, wow. A thing with two hyphens in it. <laughs> I think Daniel 
Daniel's officially lost it. <laughs> I'll do it. Do -do 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 -do. $550. I'll choose my letter when I come back from transferring the video. Folks, we're back. I just spun $550. I'm ready to call my first letter for this round, which will be an R. There are two. And there are two of them. All right. I will spin. That was very good. And besides, uh, that caller who called me from Commerce, Texas, I don't know anybody who lives there, and I've never even been there, nor do I even know where it is. I think that he's a, 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 a natural born telemarketer. Yeah, really. Telemarketers suck. Yeah, I hate him so much. Surprise! Is it the speed up round? We might be going into speed up. I don't know yet though, but I landed on the surprise. Now I have a chance to pick it up, but I gotta get a letter first. Okay, it's not surprises, but I just have my birthday. Okay, is there an N? Pick it up, one in. So find out solving the puzzle without hanging bankrupt. We'll find out just what that surprise is. In the meantime, I have that and eleven hundred in cash. I'll spin. Nice. Also, Daniel, the song gets slightly increasingly louder as, as the song progresses. So, the reason why, why I'm bringing this up is you know, Oh, it is on you. It's okay. Oh, sorry about that, folks. That's okay. Uh, never mind what we brought up, ladies and gentlemen. Why it's just a uh, technical issue. Yeah, all good. I'll have a D. There are two D's. Two D's, all right. That's <laughs> a 2D animation. All right, I will buy a vowel. A. There are four. Four A's. All right. Okay. Um. I'll spin. Good job. Thank you, Vanna. Will you go on a date with me? And of course, Daniel says to that, "What? Not to flirt with Vanna." Yeah. Want me to say that again? Yeah. Don't flirt with Vanna. I'm gonna put you already. Sounds like that's like Pete. It's actually trying to sound like Tim Zuna. Yeah, I remember. I remember him sounding that gruff. I know, but. <laughs> if, if Tim were here right now with us, he would say these three words. How dare you? $250. H, please. There is one H. <laughs> we were able to say that in this hilarious manner. And I'll buy an E. There is one One E. All right. Um, I'll spin. Good job. Thank you, Vanna. Will you go out with me? Don't worry about that. I'm going to put you over my knee. <laughs> <laughs> or whoosh. <laughs> you will be forcibly uh, obligated to have lunch on Good Burger. I will tell you this, Daniel. I would love to see you try to put me over your knee. What? I would like to see you try to put me over your knee. There is one. Oh, yeah. What's a boo boo Ow! <laughs> All right. Um, I'll spin. Nice work. <laughs> but the way you said it, Daniel, was priceless. <laughs> Absolutely priceless. No flirting with Van or I'm gonna put you over my knee. <laughs> Five fifty. Five hundred and fifty dollars. Alright. S. There is one. One S. Alright, I'll spin. 
Ready yet? No, I won't. We're going into speed up mode. That means time is running out. That means I'll give the wheel the the final spin. Spin. Yep, give that wheel a final spin. We'll be asked to give a letter. If it's in the puzzle, five seconds to solve it. Well, if it's in the puzzle, we get uh, not necessarily five seconds to solve it, but let's see. Vowels are worth nothing. Consonants are going to be worth. Well, we may have to spin again because the host can't win any jewelry, so we have to do better than that. We need a dollar amount, and let's see, we're going to end up with, well, $500 a piece. $500 a piece. Now, thing is the category. Still my turn. T? There is one T. A hard and, uh, a hard and fast rule, a hard and fast rule, a hard and fast rule. Got it! So I got $3,200 in cash, folks, but that's not all because I also got a surprise. Let's find out what it is. Let's see it. It's a jet ski worth $2,200. So let's take a look at that total for this round, $5,400. How much for the game before the bonus round? $11,650 in cash and prizes, not bad. Congratulations, you'll be going to the bonus round. Let's see if I can break $200,000 in just four games. Let's go to the bonus round. I will pick the second E. We'll show you the R, S, T, L, N, and E in the puzzle. Now give us three new consonants and a vowel. And what is our category going to be for the bonus round? It's a place. And actually, come to think of it, not once during this game did we have the category of phrase, and we never heard Vanna say, that's correct. It looks like it is correct on your end. Oh, and the solution to this place? Craig is going to be very proud of me. You know what the solution to this place is, Craig? What? Pennsylvania! Oh my god. So I better lock in on Pennsylvania, or Craig's going to send me to the moon. Pennsylvania, that is correct. Yes. Let's see what I've won. Let's see what you It was a new car last time. What is it this time, Vanna? Hope it's something good. Show it to us. It's a diamond. A thirty thousand dollar diamond ring. Exactly. Forty one thousand six hundred fifty dollars this game. How much is that now in four games? $210,350. And a fifth game is guaranteed, ladies and gentlemen. And we look forward to seeing you all for game five, as well as that next video here at Aubrey Scott Productions, coming soon. So we'll be seeing ya. And try not to get shot by Daniel Monahan's gun. <laughs> Even though it would be funny if he did.